WWE, ladies and gentlemen, Monday Night Raw was amazing, wasn't it? A lot of twists and turns, storylines being changed. Guys, it's crazy. Guys, it's crazy. You got Randy Orton once again being victorious. Had a triple threat match against Seth Rollins, which guys, I gotta say, if that match there, the funniest moment was this moment. And I gotta say, because you guys know how I feel about Seth Rollins, that was the highlight of the night. But guys, don't fret. Oh yeah, yours truly, Liv Morgan. Oh yeah, and Ruby Riot, number one contenders for the Tag Team Women's Championship. Guys, tell me something. Tell me something you don't feel it. Tell me you don't feel that energy, ladies and gentlemen. You don't feel that energy. I tell you, because all night I was going through it and I was feeling I had goosebumps, ladies and gentlemen. Goosebumps, especially when you had Shayna Baszler becoming the victorious one for her and Nia in a tag team championship match that totally upset Sasha Banks and Bailey, ladies and gentlemen, it is a big upset. As I said, the storylines are twisting and turning. We don't know what's going to happen next. I tell you, guys, we have MVP and the Hurt Pain business or whatever they run. Things are going very ecstatic in the Raw Underground. What's going to happen when Raw Underground decides to rise. I don't know. But I'll tell you one thing, ladies and gentlemen, with retribution out there, I think we have a few people by our side because there's no way I'm letting MVP try to take over Monday Night Raw because believe it or not, MVP, all it's going to take is just a snap of the finger and everything will be perfectly 